What is up everyone, it is me Siva HD. Today I'm going to be telling you how to install Discord SRV. It's got a bunch of stuff inside it which allows you to connect your Minecraft server with Discord. It's very simple to do. I'm going to show you how to do it step by step and I'm going to try to do it as quick as possible as well as you understand as possible. You get what I mean? And uh, yeah, so let's go. I've got a um, paper server as you need a paper server or a bucket server. So I don't know. But um, I've got a paper server so long as you put plugins in, you're calm and um yeah so let's get started so all you're gonna do is download the discord um srv uh, i will link it down into the description just uh go on to here you should see a download now just click download now and download it to your desktop or wherever you want and yeah just make sure you can drag it into your plugins folder okay as you see i've got mine here i'm just going to drag mine into my plugins folder as you see here and as you see it's in there so now all we're going to do is just run our server um by the way guys if you ain't got a paper server and you don't know how to make one i will link it down in the description it takes you to some guys video and he'll tell you how to do it so if we run the um if we run our server it's going to load all the libraries and then it's going to download the plugin and it's going to give you a file it's going to give you a config file which you can um customize and you see here it says no bot token has been set in the config we're also going to have to create a bot for our server so how we do that is um go to discord developer um i will link it down in the description it's gonna take you to this page here you're gonna click new application and you're gonna create um put a name in once you have done that it's gonna come up uh down here click onto it go onto bot and then go um go scroll down enable these three so this one this one and this one um and then go and uh, i think that's it yeah now we're gonna go into oauth2 i'm gonna go to ui generator i'm gonna click bot applications.commands gonna go administrator and then you're gonna click copy and then you're just going to um paste in your paste in the link and then you can add it to your server once you have added the bot to your server you should see it down here mine is right there um you can give it a role i recommend giving it admins role so it can actually have permissions to well you know text in any chat it is um it wants to so basically go into your server settings go to roles go to create role and when you create a role, go all the way to the bottom. Uh, no, go to permissions and then go all the way to the bottom where it says um, administrator. Check the administrator and you should be calm. Okay, now let's head back over to our folders. We did download the, 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 the freaking Discord thing. So if we go into our plugins, we should have a new folder called Discord SRV. And um, we're going to go into that. We're going to open up our config file. Programs you can use for this, you're going to have to use the editing software which you code on so you can use visual studio code you can use atom sublime text and those are just free you should use they're like the most popular ones so if we just um open up the config go to uh scroll down uh, i'm not scroll down go to bot token it's going to say you need a bot token so go back to the website this called developer go to your bot go to token here and if it says reset token just reset it copy it go back to your um Go back to the, the token where you need to enter it and then paste it into here. I was going to say this is coding, but this is not code. It's literally changing values. Um, but yeah, and then you're going to put your token into here. And that's basically it. You can run the bot and it works. Joking. You want to put in a channel ID so we can actually message into a channel. So open up your Discord. Make sure you got developer mode enabled on Discord. So you do this by going um, to your user settings. You go all the way down to advanced. And then you go to developer mode. Simple. This um, lets you use the Discord API. Uh, and then if you go to the Minecraft chat. So this is the Minecraft chat you want the main inf information to be. So basically normal. So we're just going to do um, copy that. Uh, copy ID. And then we can just put in the global one here. Just like that. Simple wimple. And now we're going to uh, do a console one. So the console is basically all the information. Uh, what's happening to like your minecraft server so um we do this pretty much by copying the console id or copy id and then uh, we just place it into here and that's that done now if we scroll down there's going to be a few things we can enable so we've got a webhook chat message delivery so what this does it gives you when you comment in the minecraft server in the discord chat it will give you your own little profile picture basically your own little bot icon and that and it will message with that. So you're just going to change this to true. And that should be everything. You can go down and see all stuff. You can also go into the other config files. So such as 
uh you can go into your messages change up messages see how you like it but yeah as of now that is how you set up the bot it's very simple now if we go and run our bot everything should work so if we just run as you see it's just loading up the world it's uh loading up the plugin and everything is on so if we open up our discord in the minecraft chat the global one it's going to say your server has started in the console it's going to say just this because nothing has happened Okay, I'm in the in my server. So if we just type something like blah 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 and we go over to our Discord, as you can see, it's gonna say Sivo SD has type blah blah blah. This also works the other way around. First, let me show you the console. So is the console with the show you I've done. I logged in with entity blah 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 on that uh, um coordinates, and that's my message I've sent. So now if we go here and we just type up blah 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 blah. And then we open up Minecraft. It's going to come up with my chat over there. See, Discord, Jack, da 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 da. So, yeah, guys, that's basically how you set up Minecraft chat into um, Discord. Very simple. And uh, you can do a lot of other stuff, which is plugin as well. And yeah, so um, if you want more tutorials like this, I will uh, drop, well, drop a like and I will um, show you the way because it is a very simple to do. Requires no skill at programming whatsoever. So yeah. Also that my game just looks so sexy. I'm sorry about the look. Oh.